Good day, Crafty Shems. It's Nikki and Eileen here coming at you today for International Crafters on Facebook and YouTube. And we are doodling on book paper. Don't let that scare you. <laughs> it's, it's an acceptable form of art, did you know? Yeah. Right, okay. Let's see here. I'm going to my... If you're watching and you'd like to join in the chat, please just hop on in. We don't bite. Well, not very hard. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm a little bit tired. I must yeah. not yawn. <laughs> Don't yawn on camera. <laughs> Okay, should we just get to it? Rather than trying to see if anybody's going to come in. Yeah, let's get to it. I'm going to do circles today, I think. Because that's an easy form of uh, doodling, isn't it? Circles! I'm just going to use whatever I've got by the side of me and I'm going to um, just draw. Going to use my chalk pastels at the moment. I'm just going to try and uh, use some containers to draw around. And uh, just with different sizes and things. Actually, I'm going to redo this. I mean, the paper is just kind of falling right off. Use that size, go smaller, go smaller. Mm -hmm. Not very small. <laughs> Sharpie, I'll just make it so it's you know, it's too um, thick. That one, it's a thick sharpie. Thin paper pen. Just going to go over some of my lines so I can see. <laughs> So we've been working on our patio this week. Pardon me? We've been working on our patio this week. 
as you know, because it's spring, <laughs> it's getting warmer. We have mm -hmm. thoughts of sitting out on the patio. Making it all nice. Got some planters. Mm -hmm. Nice. I think Terry wants to paint some bathroom, a bathroom up here today <laughs> when he gets home. Yeah. This is really a sticky paintbrush. In January, I might be getting my Fridays free. They, I don't know though. I don't know what they're totally up to yet. They're trying to cut back on hours, so they're thinking about closing the library on Friday. They already closed on Saturday now, so. People not wanting to come out, or not allowed to come out. Yeah. Can't see mine very good. I've got bad lighting or a bad angle, really bad angle. <laughs> this is not coming out really well. Oh. Paper soaking it up, is it? What's that? I said, is your paper soaking it all up? <laughs> mm hmm. Plug in my phone. I'll be right back, Mickey. I have to run my phone. It's on very low. Yeah, but paper can be very porous, and uh, when you actually wet it and that, it can just soak straight in. Especially the older the page. Sometimes uh, when you gluing on it, it just sets it right, right up. I'm going to be um, trying to use, uh, I'm going to mix it, mix of doodling and um, painting. So I'm hoping that mine won't get too sucked up, but hey, we'll work with it. Whatever happens, we'll get through it. We always do.
<sighs> Do the same thing. I don't like the way the thing's going. Don't like it at all. <laughs> A freehand circle's not very good. <laughs> but I'm not too worried. There we go. Uh huh. I can't trace a circle. <laughs> hey, Chloe. Chloe. Chloe, don't forget to draw your second drawing for Inktober. Don't forget to draw your second dra drawing for Inktober. Oops, that was way off line. <laughs> that circle is way off. <laughs> Terrible. Insect, I'm just going to doodle, and then where they don't inse intersect, I am just going to color in, <laughs> color in. in. <laughs> the lines of the uh, type to help me draw a straight line. Thank you. Is she waking up? I should go get a ruler. Oh, no, I have something here. Do I have something here? Oh, I do have something here. Yay.
no puppies. So today I've got to choose some plants to go in the planters. Mm -hmm. I have no idea. I'm not a gardener. Mm. Well, you can do some nice herbs that have flowers on them. Maybe. Yeah, I've done that. I've, I've actually got um, my herbs in that planted around the side, in, in planters around the side. Mm. With tomatoes and lettuce and herbs. and So this is a flowering, you know, I don't know. It might be nice to have what, some that are scented. Mm -hmm. Because we... Um, what we did was we um stop dog we, we bought some soil and that to go in and um it's it's got fertilizer in it and it stinks <laughs> sure <laughs> may need to um get some scented flowers to take myself <laughs> I like fuchsias as well, so I expect I'll get a couple of fuchsias. Mm -hmm. Jeez, Terry's calling me now. Oh, I better go answer that phone. He'll start calling the house. I think can't be very zen at the moment. <laughs> I'm a little bit zen. I find doodling helps as well. Calm, calm things down. <laughs> I'm not worried if it's not straight, straight lines. Because it is hand drawn, so hey. Which octopus is your favorite, Bubby? Well, the Quasso squid. A Quasso squid. Oh, cool. Uh, it's a really tall one. Yeah? It's tall as a building. Tall as a building? Wow, that's pretty tall. Yeah. His favorite squid is a Quasso okay. squid. Colossal. Colossal, yeah. Where has he been? Pardon me? Where has he been? Has he been to his uh, museum or something? Oh, he reads a lot. Mm -hmm. And he gets his mom to, like, you know, we read him to him a lot. So he gets all his information from books. <sighs> My two-year-old granddaughter the other day. She was mm -hmm. watching a um, documentary about whales on on the mm -hmm. telly. Mm -hmm. So um, and then she got 
sort of like in love with humpback whale and for two days straight she made her mum play whale songs the humpback whale songs uh -huh. on her phone for two days straight it was just like oh my god it would drive me crazy <laughs> song of the whale <laughs> yeah the other day he was on about uh, what was it the He's like, do you know, you know what this kind of whale this is? And he's telling, and, and I'm like, oh, like this, that's how he starts his conversation. Do you know what this is? And then he starts like, it eats whatever squid and all this stuff, right? So I'm like, oh, yeah, I know what kind of whale that is. And it's a sperm whale. And he's like, you're right, Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> so obviously his mom has been reading to him about whales. And yeah. He's got quite a few array of books about different animals. He just loves dinosaurs and all that stuff and anything he loves <laughs> it's great when kids are learning things and they're, they're just like little sponges mm -hmm. and then they get fixated on, on one thing and it's like that then you have to like <laughs> have that for day after day after day after day yeah, for a while, like for a while there, he was, I wouldn't stop talking about Minecraft or Pokemon. Oh my gosh. You know what Pokemon this is? And he's starting to tell all the, all the <laughs> Pokemon. And I'm like, okay, that's, and you gotta guess which Pokemon it is. Ugh. Well, he's off that right now, which is nice. Because <laughs> there's like hundreds and hundreds of Pokemon. It evolves to, and he's telling me the evolution, like the what it evolves to, and I was like, "Oh my gosh, Jackson!" Hi, Super Beth. Hi. Good morning. <sighs> yeah. Gotta love it when they start learning things and then get so excited by it. Mm. Yeah. we go doodling take <laughs> it's not very hard thing to do so it's a pretty easy little thing to keep busy with <laughs> <laughs> Kendra, I bought these pens for her. She's going to be coming. She's going to be like, oh, thanks, God. <clears throat> Complaining. Quite excited about getting some warm weather. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nice. 
things. Did you get away at all this year? No. no. Into the woods or anything? Mm, no. No. No, no, not, uh, not good for that. You're, you're allowed to travel in a state, weren't you? For me? You weren't allowed, you're allowed to travel, you just weren't allowed out of state or something, was it? Um, here, we weren't even allowed to go. Well, I mean, Charity did go, but we weren't really allowed to leave our province. Yeah, province, state. And yeah. then camping was shut down, so we weren't allowed to, hmm. really technically, we weren't allowed to go camping. Yeah. So unless we go in the woods on or whatever, you know, where no one is, I suppose. Yeah, we weren't really encouraged to do anything, just stay home, not even go camping or anything. Yeah. Not that. When, when we were right down in lockdown, we weren't allowed. Well, I had yeah. it out. <laughs> but um, we came out of that pretty quickly, so, yeah. Yeah, I think they opened the campgrounds and stuff a little bit more recent, not. Yeah, I see it now, yep. Awesome. Loki, stop me a breath.
I gotta go for a second here, Nikki. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just for a minute here. Sorry. <laughs> put it on you if you'd like, just for a minute. I could put mine. Yeah. See then. You there I am. Oh, I was gonna say you can see the mess of my desk now, but hey, I'm lucky it's not messy. <laughs> the mess is all pushed around the sides. <laughs> oh, I'm actually um, working in a uh, book that I started um, just for little sketches and things. And uh, on this side here, I've got a, um, a circular doodle. So um, I was thinking maybe of uh, just coming out and cutting that as a circle side. And that's why I didn't go over onto this page here. But um, hey, we'll see. <laughs> we will see. I might change my mind later on, as you often do. I just was waiting for that to dry just a little bit before I came over with the line and darkened it up. Just finishing it off. Don't know how much doodling I'm going to do. I might just do, you know, mix the doodling with the colour. But um, I'll just make up my mind as I go along. So it's you know, this is what uh, what's what it's all about. It's what it feels like to you as you doodle along. I have no rhyme or reason to it. I might do shading uh, around here where a line goes over or under, just to um. Add a little bit more interest there because right, uh, I don't know whether you can see, but there's a line. This line goes underneath this one here. So if you just put a little bit of shade in there, it helps you see that line go under or over. Made a mistake there and went over, but hey. <laughs> so this one goes under. And then you can blend it out. This is under this one and this one. And then it goes okay. under there. And then, okay, you're back. Yeah. <sighs> just slightly out of focus, but that might be just because it's having trouble on the left. Focusing on the um, doodles and that. Yep, it's better.
Yep, concentrating on doodles. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's relaxing. Oh, I find it relaxing anyway. That's nice and quiet and zen. <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't win any awards for chatting today. No. a bit washed out on camera I mean it's really weird I don't know what it's like at home but this is a um like a really neon yellow mm -hmm. it's not showing up on my screen as a neon yellow <laughs> yeah it's probably because I don't have a lot of light here Blender stump in there. Handy. Um. <laughs> <coughs> 
Oh, there's my phone again. Come on. <laughs> Just getting audience go on again. So there we are. I think your phone, she said, saying her phone keeps going off. Her house phone. Can I just check the date quickly? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay, just let me. We just would prefer to take pictures. So I'm using ink tense watercolors here if you're wondering um, why it's coming out so good because you know that when you um, when you use watercolor crayons quite often if you lay the color down first then you're left with the um, marks of the watercolor pencil in that case, it's always best to take the colour off the pencil and then lay it down. But um, the ink tents 
pencils are great for not really showing the lines. You know, you can see a couple, but not. Sorry about I that. Use with other watercolor pencils. Okay, you're back. Yeah, sorry about that. You want to take photographs at the library mm. of uh, some, somebody, an elderly, a senior. Mm -hmm. Really wanting to do that. Okay, now I just got to remember to write this time down somewhere. Well, I wrote it on my here, right here. <laughs> October 19th, 9.30. Oh, shoot. 9.30 a.m. will not work. Shoot. Okay, I just got to call her quickly back. Okay. Yeah, always check your diary first. <laughs> Helps. Helps. Should have taken this line up to there. Not just do it and then just do the line. To make a lot of sense, otherwise, let's just take it around there. Oh, well, that will be colored in. A colored in line. Oh, well, <laughs> those of you who have been watching Eileen and myself for a while now we know that Eileen is usually the one that whizzes on ahead and finishes way before me. Not today apparently, today is my day. <laughs> Saying that you're usually you're the faster crafter. <laughs> yeah. Oh shoot! I don't know why I was right. thinking nine thirty because the, the library doesn't open till ten. Silly me. Ooh. Gonna get in trouble with that one. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know what I was thinking. I was thinking that I was on top crafting. I'm thinking I'm on stream and I wasn't thinking. <laughs> oh well. I just really want to get a hold of her before she makes the other lady. Uh, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it. I got to.
actually thinking? I'm gonna call this lady back. You getting a call back? I'm just gonna call you while I call. Right. Okay. And Kardine's calling again. I think that's what she said. So I'm just putting in some shading now around the corners and things. Just to give it more depth. Help it pop a little bit more. Not that it needs to pop because it's just, you know, a bit of Zen doodling. <laughs> Using circles. Okay, sorry. I have no idea what I was thinking. Nine thirty. What was I thinking? Okay. Oh, stop fly. Stop bugging me. Right, if my computer goes off, <laughs> I'll be back in. Starting to make some noises now. Don't worry, don't worry if I get kicked off. Got a very unfortunate word around here that's just um, just out on its own there. But I'm hoping that the um, camera didn't pick it up too well. <laughs> it's not very bad, but. You know.
And I've just highlighted it as well. <laughs> yeah. Start to lock in. Oh boy, there goes my fridge. Yeah. Hey, Chloe? Yeah. Chloe, get Ducky up. Yeah, it's like half the day's gone here already. What is she doing? What a lazy butt.
Okay. Hmm. We go we're such an exciting yeah <laughs> channel today <laughs> hmm? what huh morning or should i say good afternoon hello angela how are you hello Thanks for popping into the chat. Because mm -hmm. we're not very chatty today. Yeah, we're not chatty today. <laughs> Just being a little bit zen. There we go. No. No, no, puppy. Yes, I'm all good, thank you. And you, uh, Eileen, how are you? Yeah. We're pretty good. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Good. Pretty good. Yeah, I think I went too far of doing this on it now. What's going on in Angela's world? You doing anything exciting, Angela? Is that Jackson back? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's just about to start a work day and um, I'm yeah. spending the day on, on the patio planting out my pots. <laughs> That's my exciting plan for the today
Well, I've got to go and buy the plants first. <laughs> I haven't even bought them yet. We bought the planters yesterday and um, put the compost and soil in yesterday as well. And so I'm um, planting, buying plants and planting today and tomorrow, I expect. I think I'm done, Nikki. Yeah, well, I've finished. I'm waiting for you. I just did some shading just to yeah. make it, you know, a little bit pop a little bit more. I don't think I like the paint that I added to it, the um, this, but it's not bad. It's just that I should have just left it paper color. <laughs> but. Oh boy, just wants to play that dog. Mm. Okay, I'm done. Yep, <laughs> cool. So that's our uh, projects for today. It was a bit of um, zen art, zen doodling, and uh, we chose circles to doodle with circles. And I used um, ink tense pencils and a paint pen to do the uh, obviously paint pen to do the lining, a little bit of shading. And you, um, yeah, yep. Carry on. Artist lofts and a marker, just a regular studio, and two acrylic paints and the chalks for mine. Oh. That's great. So um, thanks, everybody, for watching. And uh, we will be back again next week, hopefully on our normal day. Yep. Bye. See you all again very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.